Hi, I'm Charlotte, and I'm here to talk about artificial intelligence. Have you ever wondered, why is my autofill so crazy? You've been searching on Google, you're texting a friend, and man, some of those suggestions just seem out of left field, right? Why does that happen? Well, remember, AI is a system that uses probability and math to guess what you might type next. And these algorithms for search and texting are super low memory. There aren't a lot of resources dedicated to them because they're meant to run where you're offline or you're on a Chromebook or something that doesn't have a lot of resources. So they can't remember very much of what you've already typed. Let me give you an example. Think of a word that starts with C. Got it? Was it cat? Was it cot? Was it cute? Was it more than one syllable? Cottage? Cottages? What if I said it didn't start with the second letter as a vowel? Maybe it was CH. Think of a CH word right now. How about church or chugga chugga? You're writing a train sound. What about if it's CHR? Chrome or Christmas? You can start to see that when you start with one letter as you begin typing, there are a lot of possibilities. And then those possibilities or probabilities begin to narrow as you type more, right? That probability is called a Markov chain, and it's a probability algorithm that's used in a lot of text autofill. The problem is it doesn't remember very many letters and words. So as you begin to type a whole sentence, you end up with something that doesn't always make sense. You can type the cat and get a totally different sentence than what someone else has written before. It does remember some of what you've written in the past, but it also has to compensate for your typos. If you typed CXL, it's probably not any kind of word at all, and it's going to have to use an algorithm to make the best guess from there. So you can pretend to be a text algorithm. Go ahead, write some poetry. Write a line that you think is awesome. Have your friend write another line, the second line that's also awesome, and then fold the paper so that the person who's going next can only see the next line of the poem, and you'll begin to write like a text algorithm too. The Markov chain, it does fill in the next word that uses the letters that you've given it, but it doesn't know what you've written in the past. That poetry game, that'll help you understand. Mm -hmm.